We all love special effects in movies. We especially like to watch how they are made. And today, along with our director Ilya, we're going to launch a barrel. Barrels can't really fly, you know that, right? Well, you know, I was taught that with enough momentum, even a broom will really fly. Oh, I agree. Okay, look, a barrel for us to make it fly, yes? It's just a heavy object, right? Yes. An object, here. There are several ways that it launches, yes? That is the most common. That When you have a mortar, you see we're here, this iron ball, a cup. A cup, yes, here. You drop the charge there, and then actually pour fuel in there. Well, because our barrels will explode with fire. Oh, yes. In fact, it doesn't matter whether there will be fuel, water, sand. Yeah, there will be. Here, in any case, we transfer the energy to the barrel. Moreover, due to the pipe, we have this energy directed, right? Yeah. Here, strictly speaking, what happens if we add to the fuel, respectively, we have fire, and on top, the fire flies. Uh -huh. That's all. Which barrel do you like? Well, let's start with this yellow one. And Okay, wait, and the barrel is just standing there? Just standing. Or maybe something can be done to it. Well, this is just one of the ways when it's just placed on the bottom. Yeah. Here, but there's another way when a hole is cut. Here we can also try, yeah? You can just put it on the ground near the char so it takes off from the ground. I understand. Here, so for a beautiful flight, we need to send directional movement. Oh, more and more of some kind of is used, yes. Well, look, yes, we have so that you understand, yeah, gunpowder's charge is very small by our standards. Yeah, the usual, black powder, black powder. Yeah, a normal powder, nothing special. Here, which is in fact at the bottom of the mortar here, there should still be a little flash, which will be the fuel to ignition. Approximately how many grams are here? It's about 40 grams. Oh yeah, just a little here, so. Charged? Yeah. Yeah, everything's ready. Here at the same time, we know now the depth of the cup. Okay, take it out. Sure, like that, yeah. Yes. You have some sort of roulette, yeah? Oh, we'll measure by ancient Slavic values. One elbow. Okay, okay, a single elbow. And there's a ring of some sort. Look, yes, it's welded. In fact, a small ring, so the charge didn't increase. The story is that the charge weighs less than the fuel, and it floats on fuel. And we need to sink, right? So it's at the bottom, yes? Push to the top. From below? Got it. Here. Now look, we've got another flash. So the flash, it's magnesium, right? Yeah, its task is, in fact, just to burn the fuel, which, in fact, we have. Wait, and the gunpowder in the explosion? Ignites. It ignites. But it ignites, like, at the bottom. Yes, that's it. From the bottom. And we need it to be under on the cap. And I, I understand that on one line you hang both the flash and the charge. Of course, of course. So it'll be all at the same time. Yes, it'll work. What is a safe distance when that's the special effect we have to endure? There's an old saying, the more we rewind the wire, the calmer I feel. That is, in fact, I'd say 50 is good. Here. That's all. After that, you attach the wire we have to the remote and set the barrel up. In fact, set everything. And what if the barrel sends us to a helicopter? We won't fly that high, but in theory, it's possible. And he's... The dog will be spinning straight above us, yeah? All right, I think after the first barrel, I don't think we even come close to this area. Well, we'll see. Okay, we have the transmitter correct, yes? And to blow up, we will as always be in the distance? Well, of course, of course, we love ourselves, right? In order to understand how safe this experiment is, we will install our honorary test pilot, Vasily. Yes. And he stands close to the epicenter. We filled it with the usual mixture, only not for the cable. Diesel and I don't, nothing to set with petrol, yes. Diesel and gasoline, yes. So the barrel is charged, installed, and it's time to go away. You're absolutely right. Apparently 50 meters, right? Yes. Well, here we are at a safe distance. The crew too. And we're ready to launch this barrel. Three, two, can I push the button? Fire. Two, one.
Oh, it lit well. Oh, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. The barrel's about on the ground where it left. Look, yes, this is the earth after. It barely moved. It's called the apocalypse. Well, that is. The most dangerous is the flame, yeah? Of course, of course. And this story is a flash. Of course, come on, I'll show you the barrel. The fact that it's basically disposable after that. <laughs> It seems that this is usually how it turns out. So a barrel of 200 liters became a barrel of 100 liters? Yeah.